So it's the Valley Cafe that offers up more than just a quick cup of coffee, right? It's creating new opportunities for people who work there and customers. And it's all thanks to a former teacher who wouldn't take no for an answer. I recently went there to see how that can-do attitude is really changing lives. We will have that right out for you, Becky. Coming to work with a smile on her face isn't that hard for Raquel Crosby. And it's for a good reason. I feel all this energy that is flowing through me. In fact, Raquel tells me working at Spencer's place here in Surprise is her dream job. So what are you going to get today? She's taking orders. I like to do the register, which was really cool, and communicating with the customer. Serving pastries. My favorite is the loaf, the pumpkin loaf. And even gets a shift drink every time she comes into work. The protein decaf coconut milk latte. But it's more than just the perks of working in a coffee shop for Raquel. She's had other jobs before, but never one quite like this. Do you feel good coming to work every day? Yes, I do. Here at Spencer's Place, it has changed my life so much. And ever since I've been working here, I've been getting paid, getting all my paychecks. And this is something that I want to do for the rest of my life. It exceeds anything that I really planned for, honestly. Karen York is a special education teacher turned business owner. What are you up to today? Karen created Spencer's Place in 2019 after realizing so many of her former students weren't given the opportunities to live up to their full potential. The majority were at home. They didn't have resources. They were lonely. A lot of them just told me they were lonely. I'm here, I sure appreciate it. What was just an idea brewing in her head is now a reality and a new path in life for Raquel and so many others at Spencer's Place, which is named after Karen's son who has Down syndrome. And Raquel's not the only one who's seeing the benefits. Families with children with disabilities come in and this is home. Just like four-year-old Tommy and his caretaker, and these other regulars that I got to meet. Do you feel like this is also a place that's welcoming to you and to Tommy? Oh yeah, oh yeah. It's all inclusive. It's, that's what I love about it. This is a great example of what community can be and people being willing to accept other people who aren't exactly like us. Just seeing that it has been successful and just seeing the transformation. Oh. Do you feel like you're changing lives here? I mean, yeah, I, I, it, it's accumulative. It's, it's not me. It's just, it's the whole process. So many times in society, people with special needs get excluded or left behind. Mm -hmm. But you're doing the opposite. And most importantly, you're showing them that somebody cares. Oh, absolutely. We're, this is an inclusive workforce. Um, and, and this is proof that it can be done. Oh, I just love Raquel's smile. It's yes. just contagious. And Karen, thank you. I mean, you're just doing so many wonderful things. Spencer's Place is actually opening a second location in Surprise. So look for that early next year. In the meantime, if you'd like to check them out, they're in the shopping center off of Reams there in Waddell, just east of the Loop 303. For more information, we posted a link to their website along with this story on ABC 15. Dot com, but they're giving a lot of people hope there at Spencer's Place, and I think changing a lot yeah. of people's minds. Perspective. Right. right. It's just Absolutely. beautiful.